Post. Present arms. With all the pomp and circumstance. For liberty and justice for all. This is the final Department of Corrections graduation of 2022. You have to have flowers at graduation, right? Yes. Yeah, that's him. Yay, Daddy. Proud family and friends gathered. We are very proud. <laughs> Patrick Whitfield. To watch these men and women take the correctional officers oath, as well as the policies and procedures of the Oklahoma Department of Corrections. I will treat all employees and respect and dignity. I will obey the lawful order and those who form them. I will do myself in such a manner to enhance and satisfy the tradition of excellence for the Oklahoma Department of Corrections. Nearly four dozen new cadets are joining the ODOC contingent. You know, it's been hard being through this academy, away from our families and homes but we made our own family in blue here at this academy. I'm proud to be part of it. All ages, races, and backgrounds united by one common goal. Firm, fair, and consistent, reliable, ethnic. Big family, at least. Yeah. The Department of Corrections is a law enforcement family. That group of guys that I just took a picture with, I tell you what, they, they they're, they're, they're family. They've been with us for about four or five weeks before they came to the academy. and. Uh, I'm so excited that, that they're coming back and getting ready to go to work for us. And that, that's a fine group of men right there, and I look forward to uh, uh, working with them. These new officers will work at facilities across the state dedicated to your safety.